60 million dollars. That's what the blockade and occupation of Caledonia cost Ontario taxpayers, along with a shameful legacy of violence, terror, and illegal acts, and no respect for the rule of law. Now, three years later, we're facing a similar situation. Platnix Inc., a Canadian exploration company, has been driven from its property near Big Trout Lake in northwestern Ontario and had its equipment confiscated. And the McGuinty government has stood by, watched, and done nothing about it. Despite our dispute, we believe the KI First Nation has been victimized by government negligence every bit as much as Platnix has been. The fact is, thousands of jobs are potentially at stake, jobs that will go a long way to helping the KI First Nation become self-sufficient. While the McGuinty government dithers and hides, hoping this issue will go away, one question remains. Can we really afford another Caledonia?